Oh my god, guys. I haven't played this game in forever. Monster Energy Supercross has kind of been thrown into the back seat, and I haven't really touched it for a few weeks now. Like, it's honestly been a few weeks, so this is honestly going to be a fun video. Like, I'm hyped for this video. I was at work all day. I was like, I'm going to go home and play some Monster Energy Supercross and just record it. I'm just going to record me hopping in and playing, like, my first time back after a couple weeks off. Like, it hasn't been, it hasn't been forever. It's not like I'm going to be, like, new player to the game like i i played a couple weeks ago i've been playing mxgp pro it's just a little different you know it's, it's the little things that count and uh we're here we're back it's making a return and we got some interesting things to talk about today so let's get right in to the video So I actually don't even remember what the last Monster Energy Supercross video I uploaded was, which is kind of bad, honestly. Uh, but we're here, we're here, and I think I'm just gonna hop in and do like a single event race, but I'm not sure on what track. Maybe we should do the Monster Energy Cup. You know what? I haven't done that in forever. Let's do it. Let's do the Monster Energy Cup. Let's do it in maybe the... Should we do 250s or 450s? I think we might go 450s. Let's go 450s. We'll select... Should we do a pro rider just to change it up? I don't think I've ever ridden as a pro rider here in this game. So let's go down. Let's choose someone. Uh, who should we be? Who should we be? I think I'm going to be my boy Marvin Muskin. I love Muskin. I don't know why. I don't know why. Him or Roxon? Who should I be? Roxon. Let's go Kenny Roxon. All right. Let's get it. Ken Roxon will choose... Did it choose... Wait. What's happening? <laughs> It showed Anderson, it showed Kennard, it showed everyone but Roxon, and then it said Roxon. Like, I didn't know what was happening, but all right, we're back. We're, we're back going good. It's going good. Okay, that, that was uh, interesting. Okay, good good way to start the video. Um, I want to say this, guys. If I sound sick, if I look sick, if, if, if like... I'm gooning it up. I apologize because I'm, I'm kind of recovering from an illness. My, my throat is literally like killing me. I don't know why. Like everything went away. Like I was puking. I had a headache. Like everything went away except for my sore throat. Like I feel 100% fine except for my throat. And uh, it, it's one thing that, that like sucks about when you're trying to make videos. Okay, let's get this going here. Uh, one shot, normal, realistic, short. How long are the short races? Yeah, we'll do short because it's three races three laps each okay okay we're getting her going we're getting her going so we're gonna do three laps because it's three laps of three races and that would be a long video if we did like 10 laps imagine that holy crap we'd be doing 30 laps here on this track but one thing i want to say is like if you're just sick where like you know oh my my head is kind of groggy or whatever you can still make videos if you have a sore throat you can't really make videos like it, it really it really puts a damper on that it makes it it makes it hard and especially when you have no energy like i was literally stuck in bed for like a whole day like i i didn't want to do anything and it's probably good that i stayed home from work the one day and just slept because like you need that recovery you need that recovery and i'm not saying that because like i want to be here and make videos but i want to be back at work i want to be ma making money right like youtube doesn't really make me money and uh if, if it was i wouldn't be working that that's a little tip right there if this was making me good money i would not be working but all right here we go 78 percent loaded i'll just have to wait i feel like maybe we should have went ahead and done like five laps because a three lap race is pretty short think about that like we can't really do any comebacks or anything because you don't have any time to make a comeback but we'll let everyone go off the start we'll be like last place off the start and, and see what happens i don't know what's gonna happen man this is gonna be interesting i've only played this track a couple of times so it should be fun and this is exactly what i wanted to do in this video just come chill out play play some monster energy supercross and have some fun with it if you guys do enjoy it at any point in time make sure to smash that thumbs up button for me go down in the comments let me know your favorite part of the video any part of the video just let me know oh my god okay that that works you know that works <laughs> And uh, if you're new around here, guys, a subscribe would be much appreciated. I did not mean to, like, ram right into them. I swear I was on the brakes and it did not do anything. It, like, glitched. I have no idea. I don't know. But I wanted to let them kind of get the start. This game handles so much different. Or so much different. Is that English? <laughs> it handles so different. Oh, my God. What's happening? <laughs> it handles so different than uh, MXGP Pro. We're riding on people's heads. 
Like, this is gonna be gnarly. This is gonna be gnarly. I gotta remember that, like, you can't really crash from casing, so I should just, like, full send. Full send everything. Overshoot everything. Just go for it. We're playing as Kenny Rocks, and we're chilling in 8th place. And I wish I remembered this track. It'll come back quick. It'll come back pretty quick. Oh, that's actually a jump. What the heck? We hit such a low lip that I thought it was like a wall. Dungy getting back past us. We got three motos to try and pull an overall, but... You know, if we win all three, we get that million dollars, you know? We get that million dollars. Can we actually make it into that section? Like, what were we supposed to do there? I think maybe choke up like they did? <laughs> I don't know, I think we got through a little quicker than them. Like, we're gonna pass these guys so quick. Oh, man, we're down! I shouldn't, I shouldn't have said anything. I shouldn't have said anything. We were like, we were like on track taking that lead and then all of a sudden as soon as I started talking about it we decided to go down should I take the joker lane do we have to does it actually count it and like can you only take it once do you get penalized if you take it twice oh I ruined it I ruined it no way no way I did that oh my goodness I'm riding like a goon I'm riding like a goon guys it's been a while though I gotta get used to this game again I didn't think it was this different from MXGP Pro, but it is. It's a little different, like, in the handling. The handling is totally different. Like, MXGP Pro, I would say, handles a little more realistic, but this game is almost more more fun, because you can just pin it to win it. I don't know. Pro Physics, like, I'm still on the fence about them, just because, like, sometimes, man, sometimes the crashes are a little cheesy. All of a sudden, we're up into second with Anderson out front, two laps to go. Well, one lap once we uh, cross the finish line, but I don't see anything keeping track of like the the Joker lane. Oh, right there in the top right. Top right, it's like Joker lane. All right, so we took it. We took it, I think. That's good. That's good that we did that. <laughs> or we would have missed it this lap because I didn't even think about it. I wonder what happens if you don't take it. Is it like, penalize you or I don't know because it's actually a faster line so I guess it wouldn't do anything unless you take it twice if you take it twice then is it like bam penalized but I don't know I don't, don't actually know if they did anything went that far in this game we got Anderson up here who got really sketch in that section and then someone who is it is it Reedy Chad Reed right up on our butts here after he must have just took the the joker lane and uh on the last lap here and He's right on us. I don't think we're gonna get Anderson. That one crash literally ruined our race, but... I'm not giving up until it's over. I should be scrubbing these. I, I like the scrubs in this game. They're not bad. Oh my god, that's the corner that ate, it, ate us last time. Ate us alive. And then of course that time we ran into Anderson. Let's see if we can at least salvage a podium, man. I'm cheesed. I'm cheesed. We always get the short end of the stick. We were getting sketch. <laughs> we were getting sketch coming out of there. Oh, I don't think I don't think we're gonna get back past him. Nope. Alright, fourth place for the first moto. That's brutal. That's brutal. I didn't think we were gonna uh, come together with Anderson there. Like we were getting squirrely. We were getting a little squirrely in the corner. And I was like, alright, let's take a chill pill. Tried to straighten out, and then as I tried to straighten out, I like hit him. And it just sent me to the ground, so fourth place for the first moto. I can't complain about that. We'll have to uh, try and get some redemption in the following motos. Hopefully Anderson, Reed, and Tickle kind of mess up because, uh, dang. <laughs> dang. That was my warm-up, guys. Man, one thing I did not miss about this game were the loading times. Holy crap, that took forever to load. Like, if I put that in the video, I would have been just babbling forever. I would have I would have ran out of stuff to babble about, and that's tough for me to do. Oh, man, we actually get to choose a gate. Let's go. I think we might choose right beside Reedy. Right beside Reedy. All right. All right. Okay, let's see if we can maybe get some redemption here. Moto number two. Let's see what happens. I have a different strategy for this one. I'm gonna I'm gonna let them go I know I kind of like rushed things in the first moto and I didn't really like let them go I tried to like go off the start, but I'm gonna let them go so that we're starting in like last and then uh, I'm gonna take the joker lane at a different time. We took it what second lap last time and I think I'm gonna go ahead and take it Like right off the bat 
not right now i don't know if it counts right now if you do it but oh my god how are we in how are we in second i'll take it you know what like i'll take it but what the heck happened what the heck happened to everybody that's weird we're gonna have to battle with web the whole moto here we go through the sand this section is so weird i wonder what they did in real life like just full send or what oh <laughs> me and web both case in that i'm gonna get the advantage i think but guys, there are some big changes coming to the channel here. Like, I've been uploading... Well, I know you guys probably see it if you're subscribed to the channel. I've been uploading Fortnite. I've been uploading different kinds of games and stuff. And I'm trying to grow in different different areas. And, like, I love doing the modal games. They're going nowhere. They're going to stay on the channel. It just might not be as frequent. And I know that's a bummer because, like, the majority of my channel right now is is moto like is subscribe my, my subscribers are here for the moto right like let's be real but uh like there's so much potential so much potential in in other games that i think it's kind of <laughs> like like i see the potential just by uploading certain videos and stuff i'm like wow like if i if i imagine doing that every day if i was doing that every day like my channel would be on another level if i was doing that from the start like i i used to upload my first video on this channel was a call of duty video and it got 300 views and then all of a sudden i just stopped that imagine if imagine if i just went ahead and kept going and kept going like 300 views i uploaded a couple of them and like they were all getting consistent like hundreds of views so if you just stick at the, or, or stick with it like hundreds turn to thousands and then you never know what can happen right like i see here with the mx games like there's a lot of hype around the release of the games and certain things like reviews and all that like reviews of new content and the new game right when it comes out like oh how is it and of course people are just gonna sit there and be like oh it's good it's it's great and i've done that before but like i, I want to change how the channel works and i don't think the moto games are the best way to grow like they're a consistent way to grow and i, I love the moto community man like you guys are the real mvps but I really think there's an opportunity for more growth like elsewhere and I think at this point like sitting down and seeing that like I either got to go for it or it, it's not it's not worth it right like why would I want to sit here and grind it out to let me restart so the modal community it's not huge all right it's not huge like you're gonna max out at some point there's not a there's not a huge amount of moto youtube watchers i guess if that makes sense and you gotta grow into other games and i see people going into other games like like i don't even know like other off-road games which then again have smaller communities and those smaller communities are easier to grow in and this is one way to grow using these kind of smaller communities to your advantage like growing in the moto community it's not that hard you just have to kind of know what you're doing search engine optimization and all that and produce some quality content or at least some decent content and then stay consistent and i promise you the growth will come and that happens with a lot of games so imagine if imagine if i was doing it with games with like 300,000 times <laughs> the amount of viewers like it's true it's true like the most viewed moto gaming video probably doesn't even have like a quarter of the video video views as the most viewed like fortnite vi video or like call of duty video it's just true it's just like the triple a titles are just like way way up there and i think it's it's a it's worth it to, to go for it I think it's worth it to go for it and, and try and take that step into that category and start playing those games because those are the games I truly enjoy. Like I love playing moto games, but they're not the games I want to like base my whole my whole channel around. I don't know. This sounds weird. Like <laughs> I've been playing moto games forever, like forever. And to be saying this, like it, it does sound weird, but like I, I think there's an opportunity elsewhere. For the channel and i think we need to kind of take it that way if that makes sense and i think it'll be good for us as a whole for the goon squad as a whole so that was a rant for that that race we won the moto we're in second for the overall right now and we probably need to win this race to actually get the win i think it's what anderson who's who's right there with us so we get first gate pick i think we might go like 
should we go tight inside oh we get to choose anywhere i didn't know we could have chose the other side of the gate last time no way no way <laughs> i thought it put us on that side okay here we go let's go like second yeah let's go right here but yeah like i don't know if that rant in the second moto really made sense but like i want to go elsewhere with the channel just because there's there's a bigger opportunity to grow in those areas like the moto videos are going nowhere and i think one reason why i'm like pushing myself so hard to like try and go for other things is because we all like change like we all like different things too like we we burn out on things i can only play moto games and, and do like career mode playthroughs for so long with the new games like it's true it's true like you can't sit down and do a career mode playthrough for every new game forever well you can but like by the end of it like it, it gets stale it gets boring and they're generally like the same same videos so i would rather like you know put more time into the videos and produce different moto videos for you guys like like in-depth videos on like you know this bike versus that bike or this exhaust versus that exhaust or what's the best exhaust in the game you know like things like that like i want to change my content if that makes sense as well like not even necessarily just change the games that i'm playing like i've always played fortnite i've always played cod here on the channel i've been kind of doing like strictly moto for a while now but cod if you go way back like it's there fortnite it's there it's been there for a while and i want to just try and like change my content and see if i can grow into different areas and the moto it, it's going nowhere i just want to bring more like entertaining videos for you guys i know you guys probably love the career mode playthroughs but like they're dry they're stale let's be real like if you could watch a 10 minute like action-packed informative video versus someone sitting down and just playing a career mode which one would you choose which one would you rather watch like something that's gonna benefit you or something that's just gonna take like 20 minutes of your time and you'll get to see someone ride on a track right like i don't know it's just the way i look at it like i'm kind of burnt out on the moto games and i'm in need of change i'm in need of change just to keep that drive and keep myself going and i want to see growth in other areas and like right now like when i upload a moto video and it does good i'm like oh yeah moto did moto video did good but like when i upload a fortnite video and it does good or like a, a crew video and it does good it's like man see like those videos do good too like it, it's a possibility to upload those a lot and grow in that area and it's just like always on my mind thinking about like growing into different areas and all that and it needs to happen like i've talked about it in a bunch of videos and i just need to make it actually actually come to life and, and happen so i think it's gonna happen here you know coming towards the end of summer i i have some plans i've always had had the plans but uh i gotta go for it i just gotta go for it and i think we're gonna i think we're gonna guys take that leap leap of faith like you're never gonna know you're never gonna know if it's gonna work out if you don't go for it you miss 100 percent of the shots you never take now my only worry is that like i push towards other games like the crew 2 forza horizon 4 uh fortnite the new cod when it comes out battlefield like rainbow six if i push towards like all those games and i i kill my channel like i don't want to kill the channel and that that's one thing that actually is like on my mind i could just potentially end up like losing everybody everyone being like man like this guy uploads the weirdest stuff like i don't want to watch this anymore and like yo what happened in the moto stuff and all that like i don't want to kill kill goons of gaming you know so i don't know we'll see what happens in the future the future is bright guys i don't know it's only up from here and uh, i've learned a lot over like my two years of doing youtube so i think I think it's time to put that knowledge knowledge to use. Now the first the first whip I threw in this whole race, holy crap. All right guys. So we took two moto wins, we got a fourth in the first moto and I think that means we took the overall. Let's go take a look. Bam. All right. So we did. We got 6 points followed by Anderson who got 10 and then Reed. Chad Reed, man, the vet coming in with 11 points in third. So not a bad video at all. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure to smash that thumbs up button for me. And other than that, guys, I'll catch you guys all in the next one. Peace.